name is Dex from My Consult and today we'll be looking at how customers can actually earn bonus points from sales invoices and then how they can actually redeem it for different different products. Alright, so if you want to know the different methods of how AutoCount can calculate those bonus points, please find the link to the other video in the description below. Also, before we continue, do like and subscribe to be notified when we release new guides. Alright, okay, so the first thing you need to do is to make sure that you have the module already. So to do that, you can come here to Tools here. Come here to program control come here to module setting all right so from here you can actually see there's one module called bonus points make sure it's tick if you don't have that module contact your dealer or you can actually call us for any assistance all right okay so let's say for example now we have that set up we want to create an invoice for bonus points redemption so we come here to invoice So come here, let's say example is DAX, and then from here we press plus, we can select a few items, say hardware, 130 ringgit, we select another item, say hardware 2, say this is $10.50. So if you look at here, right, when you put $10.50, the points redemption will only be 10 instead of 10.5, right? So because we always based on for every dollar um, spent, you get one point. So if it's 50 cents, the system won't calculate for you that extra 50 cent points okay so then we press plus and then we select another item say come here we say open item and then we say this is also ten dollars and fifty cents all right so you can see it earns us 150 points from here okay so once we're done we just press save okay so that's how we can actually calculate or earn points while we generate invoices in the system okay so the next part is how can we use the points to redeem items? So one of the things that we need to preset is of course we can come here to stock here. We come to stock item maintenance. We need to set what are the points you need to redeem a particular item. So let's say example this Coke can. We can double click inside in here. Okay. Let's edit it. And then from here we have others. And then from here you can see how much points that you need to redeem this item so we say we want to put this as two so for every two points i can redeem a coke can press okay all right so now how a customer wants to redeem it you can come here to bonus points you have one called bonus points redemption all right so let's say we want to create a new bonus point redemption we just press new and then from here we can select our customer say tax okay and then from here we can say redeem items okay. and then we press plus and then let's say for example we select our coke can so this coke can straight away the bonus points will be here too so let's say example i want to redeem 10 coke cans system calculate for me and this is the number of points available redeem how much and then of course what's my balance so there's also another situation where you did not key in the bonus points redemption so let's say example we select another item say hardware 2 so if we don't redeem or we have not preset the redemption points it will show as zero but as a user you can straight away can come in here and say okay to redeem this item i need 100 points on the spot you can actually select and you can actually put it there all right so once you're done we just press save and the items will be redeemed your stock will be deducted as well okay and the final section is there will be a scenario where we will have to adjust the bonus points a member has so this can be done through here bonus points bonus points adjustment all right and then we press new okay so let's say example this is a vip customer bonus points adjustment okay so Let's select our member. So we can select who's our members here, say tax. And then after that, let's say for example, if you want to increase the number of points, we just press here 100, then this will increase the points by 100. If you are reducing its points, then you must put a negative, say 20, to reduce its points by 20 points, okay? So this is actually how easy it is to manage bonus points in AutoCount. Do let us know if you have any guides you would like us to cover in the future. Thanks.